All right. Some of these problems are starting to get difficult. Um, you really need to know your trig properties. So I do know on the top that this is essentially the double angle of the cosine squared. And we can actually convert it to cosine squared minus sine squared um, squared like that. And on the bottom, we can divide this into cosine squared uh, theta. Let me put theta there. Minus sine squared theta <sighs> times cosine squared theta plus sine squared theta. So these cancel out. And um, what we're left with is 2 cosine squared theta minus 1. And this is another trick property. This is simply equal to 1. So that works out pretty nice. So we end up with 2 cosine squared theta minus 1. Um, so I can do 2 times and then take this and do 1 minus sine squared theta minus 1. So this becomes 2 minus 2 sine squared theta and then minus the 1. And that's how we end up with, with um, 1 minus 2 sine squared theta. Hey, that works out pretty nice. All right. I hope that helped you out quite a bit. Uh, thank you for watching. Have a great day.